Mixing sports, history, and civil rights, a recent documentary highlights the challenges players in the Negro Baseball League had to face. Tonight, the Reds Youth Academy held a screening. Local 12's Brad Underwood was there and spoke to some teens afterwards about it. The Other Boys of Summer tells the story of racism and segregation through the lives of Negro League baseball players. The film, narrated by the late Cicely Tyson, took creator Lauren Miner 12 years to make. I wanted to explore racism and segregation through the lives of those who were really living through it and trying to pursue their dreams in spite of their circumstances. Tonight's screening is both a treat and a history lesson for about 125 members of the Reds RBI baseball and softball teams at their youth academy. It's kind of messed up, but like, I, f like, I understand like they really, they really love the game of baseball, so like they're going to take everything and anything to do it. The film highlights the conditions and treatment players faced in the 1940s prior to Jackie Robinson breaking baseball's color barrier. I say segregation now, segregation tomorrow, and segregation forever. That was a, a rude awakening for me because I had never been South before. And at night when I go to bed, I just, just cried, you know. It made me feel better. Former Reds player and scout Marlon Stiles Sr. says he hopes the kids see just how resilient these players were. But they were bridging a lot of gaps along the way in regards to what was going on in the country at that time, in regards to where they could and could not sleep, where they could and could not eat, and where they could and could not go. Something Avery Rover says is inhumane. Disrespectful. I think it's sad that they had to go through those things just because people thought that they weren't equals. But Meyer says in her interviews with the players, anger and bitterness never came through. All of these players went through real challenges and discrimination just to play the game that they loved. And in spite of it all, they share their stories with such joy and pride. In Roseland, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. Ah, looks like a great film there. To learn more about that film, head to local12.com.